There we go. Time to get glass. Just remember this is a two times multiplier on the loot, so I'm getting twice as much cloth as one would normally get. <coughs> it also allows for 20 uh, times stacking. So instead of me having to have a bunch of drop boxes outside to basically dump all the cloth in after each row, <coughs> or a couple of rows, because I mean like <coughs> 20 plants is what, even with the base thing, 20 plants would be basically a thousand cloth, and you stack about a thousand cloth at a time, and before you know it, your inventory is completely gone. So. Did I collect all this? I did. Okay, let's collect here, right? Everything on the second pass. That's why you have a second pass. Well, I mean, technically it's not a second pass. It's a pass in the opposite direction, right next to where you previously were, in order to pick up on things that you missed. And that's why I usually like to leave the middle one because it's easier to see. Rather than the one right next to the wall, I have fixed this in the third level of this farm because using windows instead of path things, the bottom of the window is about the same level as the uh, top of the planter, so you can pretty much just crowd walk from planter through the window. Um, Okay, well, my fingers got starting to get tired from all this pressing. It has been, and visually inspect, make sure we've got every last one. Uh huh. an auto sort of presser for this E button. Or something that speeds it up. Uh, I am possibly pressing it about 2,000 800 times, and you had this one. I actually have another 
breed one with four whites. As what's not significant with this farm setup is the um, the time it takes. Because I mean, I just harvesting one of these things takes forever, and you kind of want to let it get to the point where it's. Um, mature before you harvest it anyway. Let's get through this quickly because I want to go for a walk. I'm not exactly how long it, I haven't actually check the time. I know it takes 18 minutes to plant all these. Just under 18 minutes to plant this. Like 18 minutes minus 10 seconds to plant all this and yeah, a gigantic farm like this is a lot of work. And I mean, technically, you know, them less than a week into the white, and they easily have over 100,000 scrap, which is basically enough scrap to buy whatever you need. Whatever you need. Like, I'd like to buy some HQM, please. And I was built, building sort of ordinary farms. I suppose the very first farm that I considered to be a mega farm uh, was a thousand and eighty. Thousand and eighty So you can see the new the design here that I want to you know implement re implement downstairs. Instead of having the half slabs you have windows. Which means you can put the, uh, whatchamacallit, the heater higher up. Uh, so it's not going to bump into you as you're trying to do whatever you need to do. And also there's the, the window parts you can easily see through, easily reach through. To, like if you're going down a row and you missed one, you can easily reach through to uh, the other side and grab one that you missed while you, you know going through a row here. Like I'm going through this row here. And let's say I missed one. Now, as I'm going, oh, I can see it. Oh, see it. And I grab it as I pass back in the opposite direction. And there's no there's no odd rows because I don't have to deal with the you know doing the, the, the heater row, rows first. Because that's the problem downstairs is that I have to do the heater rows first because I know I'm going to bump into them a lot, and it's it's better to try and do it when you know your left index finger is still you know not completely tired. I mean, Jesus, this finger's my le left index finger is definitely getting much stronger, and I'm probably developing serious muscles on it from. All this fucking clicking, I mean, clicking, pressing, whatever. 
I mean, like, seriously. Just craziness. Did some aim training, uh, 10 hour aim training with uh, Tommy because I know you like using Tommy, and also did a bit on the MP5 and the AK just to be certain. And of course, I did a bit of a little bit of aim training on the SARB and the M39 because those are. Those are kind of my favorites. I prefer those ones. And uh, I, I hate gold. Age. Having to fully pop it after every goddamn shot. That's just. I mean, it's like, why? Why would you do that? I mean, like, sure, if it's the only sniper rifle you have, you gotta do what you gotta do. But otherwise, why? 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 If you have the choice. Ready! So. That's it. Um, nope.